Hello friends and welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to learn how to summarize the data in Microsoft Access 2016. Now in Microsoft Access 2016, it is very difficult to create a report right from the scratch by fetching data from multiple tables. Let's take for an example that we have a customer table, we have an orders table and let's say that we have a total sales table. Now I want to create a report in such a way that I want a summary of all these three things. Now in order to do that I will by default I will go to the report design, create a report and fetch data from different tables. Now to create such kind of report it will be very hectic and it will be very complicated. So in order to summarize the data in a very simplest manner I will go to the report wizard that you will find under the create tab and under the create tab you have to go to the reports group out there you will find a report wizard with the help of which we can create a report from the single totals query and it will help me to summarize the data quite efficiently and quite neatly we will have a better understanding how to summarize our data in our practical approach in this video we are going to learn how to summarize data in microsoft access 2016 Alright, so in order to do that, I will have to go to the create tab and under the create tab, I will go to the query design. The moment I click on query design, now my query tools pop up and it is basically asking me what are the two tables which you like to include and create a summary for. So I will pull out this particular table that says customers and I will take this order item table and I will simply hit on the add button. So I have my two tables ready out here, the customer table and the order item table. So what I'm trying to do out here that I would like to know that which customers has ordered which item and what is the quantity of that particular item. This is what I'm trying to create a summary for, right? So basically what are the details which I'll be needing? I'll be needing their first name. Perfect, so I just simply double click on it. It gets added out here. I want their last name. Right, uh, let's add some city. So I'll go to scroll down. I would like to add the city. I want to know what is the order ID. So if, if I simply double click on the order ID, it is showing me the order ID. And I want to know what is the total co quantity that they have ordered. So, so far so good. I have all my field list ready. I need to create a summary that I want to know what is the total number of quantity that the particular customers has ordered. So I'll go ahead under the design tab and under the design tab, I will select the totals because I would like to know the total number of quantity. So now I have the total group right now. So I, here it is group by group by, but for quantity, it will be the total. So I'll select on this drop down menu and select sum. All right, so basically I have all the details which are required. We have filled in the information. Now go, we will go ahead and run this query and see whether it's giving out me the right information or not. So I'll go to the result tab and I'll simply select to run. The moment I select on run, I now have the design for this particular query. It's saying, giving me the first name, the last name, the city, which they belong to, their order ID and the sum of the quantity. So basically it is giving me the overall summary that what is the total quantity uh, ordered by this particular customer, right? And what are the different products that they have ordered? This is the order ID. They have placed an order various other times. And what is the total number of quantity they have ordered, right? In this way, I can create a summary for any table, which if you wish to, with the help of query design, right? So this is how you summarize data in Microsoft Access 2016. 